Just in family, Fat Cheat, White House releases first ever comprehensive framework for responsible development of digital assets. This was put out today, 10 minutes ago, family. Family, like what I've been trying to explain to you guys, with this whole bear market, this bear market is supposed to be here. We're not supposed to be at all-time highs right now. The government is not ready right now. They're following procedures, okay? Following the president's executive order, new reports outline recommendations to protect consumers, investors, businesses, financial stability, national security, and the environment family. The digital assets market has grown significantly in recent years. Millions of people globally, including 16% of adult Americans, have purchased digital assets which reached a market capitalization of $3 trillion. Globally, last November, digital assets present potential opportunities to reinforce U.S. leadership in the global financial system and remain at the technological frontier. But they also pose real risks, as evidenced by recent events in crypto markets. The May crash of the so-called stablecoin and a subsequent wave of insolvencies wiped out over $600 billion of investors and consumer funds. Okay, so you guys know uh, March 9th, President Biden executive order had came into play. All right. <clears throat> now, you know, they're trying to do the CBDCs and have everything up and running. So protecting consumers, investors, and businesses Digital asset pose meaningful risk for consumers, investors, and businesses. Prices of these assets can be highly volatile. The current global market capitalizations of cryptocurrencies is approximately one-third of its November 2021 peak. Still, sellers commonly mislead consumers about digital assets, features, and expected returns. So, it's when, when they're saying stuff like that, they're basically talking about people who are just trying to pressure you or push you to buy certain digital currencies. Now, <clears throat> what you guys know about Crypto Brown, I speak about Dogemon. I speak about XRP. I speak about Yeti Coin. I speak about XLM. I speak about Chainlink. These tokens are going to be huge. Do you understand, family? And it keeps on going. The reports encourage regula regulators like the Securities and Exchange Commission and Commodity Futures Trading Commission, consistent with their mandates to aggressively pursue investigations and enforcement actions against unlawful practices in the digital asset space. Okay, family? Family, this is huge. Um, <clears throat> hopefully later on today I can go on live and break down more of this statement from the White House. But with this being said, family, they are ready to push the button and to let you guys know that digital currencies is in effect. Now, if you read this here, to promote safe and affordable financial services for all, the administration plans to take the following steps. Agencies will encourage the adoption of instant payment systems like FedNow, but they're talking about FedNow, but you know it's XRP, by supporting the development and use of inno innovative technologies by payment providers to increase access to instant payments and using instant payment systems for their own transactions, okay? So basically, if it was a disaster or emergency, you will be able to get instant payment just like that. The reason why is 2020 was just a test run. I believe they were using XRP when they were sending out payments. Family. So family, this is huge. And <clears throat> what's going on from May and now and maybe till next year, it's just the beginning. And I hope you guys are being prepared. 
I hope you guys are being responsible of how you're spending and where your money is going and what digital assets are you investing in. But let me go back over here to Dogalon Mars. He says, I can't be cloned. My DNA is special. And Dogalon, me and Dogalon Mars have been going back and forth. So there's a lot of things that I have been seeing that they say uh, there's another Elon coin. I understand most people want to jump onto different tokens, but all I know right now is Dogalon Mars cannot be cloned. I know a lot of things has not been coming out basically with the nfts and everything else but you guys have to understand is it's a process it's not easy it's not easy getting everything out how it's supposed to be at this time because it's like this no one thought uh artemis was going to go to the moon nasa sending stuff to the moon no one thought spacex was going to uh, they were sending satellites out in space Orbiting Mars for telecommunication once we get things built on Mars. So, family, be humble, be wise, be smart. We are the new pioneers. Thank you, guys.